Have you guys been into Officeworks recently? I am blown away by some of the things that we found in store. Come and check it out. So I was heading in here to have a look for some contacts because I need it for a project. And I thought, let's have a look around and see what's new. And I saw that all these highlighters were here. I haven't seen them before. If you have, let me know. I saw this gold one. So I did a little line to show you guys what it was like. I was so impressed. I know all the pens in general look good, but yeah, super happy to see all those. And then, of course, they have this massive art section there are just aisles and aisles and aisles of stuff so you've just seen all those paint brushes that are there and then they have this massive aisle of paints there's acrylic paint there's water based paint oil based paints I don't know whatever the paints are there's a lot of them they have this little thing that my daughter said hopefully no one thinks it's a juice pouch of course they have all the Cricut machines and accessories here so much stuff it looks really good looking at it all there i know that spotlight has a lot of stuff too but i was so impressed to see it in here and then look at all these creative things they have here scrapbooking stuff papers stickers washi tapes just embellishments whatever you need i was so shocked to see it was here of course, I'm filming for myself too, <laughs> so I can keep a mental note of what is in here and then hopefully come back here one day with a bit of a plan. Officeworks don't really do sales like a lot of the other shops do, so but I have found the prices here are so good with what's around. Super impressed with this, the wax sticks that are here with the wax seal. They are getting very popular right now. The ink and the stamp sets here, all of the stickers and stuff that are here, as well as more craft and create stencils, the ganza bags, plastic bags, boxes, packaging. Oh, like so much stuff. Oh, I was impressed by those wooden boxes down below. In the next aisle, they have, of course, more paint. This is all the spray paints, but look at all the cupboards that are there. Of course, they're all locked up for safety. And then we have moving into the drawing section, all the pens, uh, chalks, pencils, all the stuff. Um, This is an oil area i think from memory i can't remember i just filmed everything i saw because i thought if you're an art person or you have an art person and you're watching this you'll have an idea of what's going on these are inks i did know this i've seen them before and i was so impressed by how big the range is i just think for this being office works it's not an art store but it feels like i was in one sorry one-stop shopping literally and now at officeworks you can scan your flybys card as well so bonus there some more inks that are here super little cute but this is the thing that massively caught my eye copic markers they are so popular for artists especially those that do uh, anime drawing and manga and look at this color range they are a little bit pricey a pen on its own can be about 20 30 dollars just depending but if you buy them in the packs they're a lot cheaper but they have the best tips on them and it allows you to do blending and just the best artwork so yes for the artists out there they will know exactly what i'm talking about so yep here are an idea of some of the palettes and the packs that they have here you see they've put together a bit of a color pack to give you guys an idea i love this aisle because this reminds me of childhood so they have here sculptly this is like a plasticine molding clay thing and then down the end here is fimo so of course one brand is a little bit more expensive than the other but still gives you an opportunity for all of your making needs up the top is all of the accessories, of course, with anything that you need to make stuff. Into the next aisle, and they have pencils galore, colored pencils, packs, etc., etc. I just think the way the Office Works has all the colors laid out, it just makes you 
feel so happy that you're walking through a rainbow and all the normal pencils on the side so in this little case they had the entire set here of the fable castell so i thought i'd just take a bit of a film for you guys to show you in the next aisle, because we were going aisle by aisle, because that's what you do at Office Works, I was so impressed to see all these colours in all the packaging and all oh, this book. Oh, I thought 30 Reasons Why You're My Bestie. And in here, you can write little things and notes to your best friend. If you were an animal, you would be a. Uh, let me know down below. If you were an animal, what would you be? <laughs> oh, I would be a squirrel. <laughs> Uh, I loved this pack and the embellishments and then I saw this put down your phone and I said yeah no thanks so put that one straight back and of course the sticker book these always catch my eye I'm looking at maybe doing a planner again next year and so you gotta need stickers that's the rule <laughs> it helps your creativity to try and put some things together then look at this washi tape oh this is all the rage right now and of course yes if you're into planning you're gonna need some so reminder to self they are here next check out these magnets they look so cute the sushi and the food and the little shapes definitely something upscalable compared with the magnets that were on the fridge when i was a little one and australian animals represent yes so so super cute the last thing that i saw was these boards and oh i think they look so good I've been seeing them everywhere lately and I think that the fact that they're reusable and they're not just a typical whiteboard, they just look very elegant, especially with the little gold. So yes, let me know if you have used one of these before. They look like something I could use in the house. Then again, I'm not sure <laughs> that I would actually get it. I might get it, but I might actually not use it. The last bit here we have is just some more stickers for planners. Let me know if you're a planner girl and if you use stickers. And do you have a theme? Because I hear that it's good to have a theme of stickers in your planner. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.